Hello everyone, Morp here with an update to the new legendary crafting system coming to Fallout 76 on September 3rd. Stick around till the end of the video to get some tips to maximize your time remaining here to uh, learn all the good stuff and everything that's going to be going on. So let's get started. So there was an update to the PTS that I went and checked out today uh, just to go and see if there were any glaring changes. Uh, so far everything does look like it's still basically the same from um, the video that I posted before. There's a link in the description for the other two that I've done. Um, but I do want to go over a few things that I did kind of refine in the search. If you see here is the list of all of the different possible box mods and the Slayer stuff and like the Assassins and the Aristocrats and Mute Slayers and all the, these box mods, they are actually usable on both of them. So if you do you know, learn Aristocrats, you're going to be able to put that box mods on either a weapon or armor. And um, also durability, you know, the break slower. And uh, we'll have to wait and see if there are any other changes on the PTS. I only learned about 27 of the different box mods, so I wasn't able to test everything out. And there's also a link here um, down in the description for Mapex's awesome list with the different items that are going to be um, used when you're actually crafting the box mods. Okay, so to go over some, some really simple tips that you could be doing right now, um, Bethesda did release a note today saying that it is very much confirmed that the Legendary Cores are going to be out of the game during the, the update. Now, we also have a cool update for the remaining time till the update comes. There's going to be a thousand script, like a double script weekend, but now it's double script two weeks. And this is going to be really useful for you to... Um, maximize your time to get rid of the cores so like let's say you have uh, like this alt here has 4,000 legendary cores and just a couple modules here um, like enough I want to make sure that I can get rid of that so the time remaining I can really pump out the uh, the script here to to get them to a point where they can uh, get rid of all those cores and now on this alt here you can see that I have almost 5,000 uh, cores and a whole bunch of modules See, this particular alt, I'm going to wait until the very end and uh, I'm going to plan out my attack here because it's going to be a lot of things that I'm going to be able to roll here and I'm going to be very heavy. And uh, so, yeah, that one's going to wait until the very end. And also, like we've stated before, uh, one really, really good thing that you, you should do on the very last day, if you do have the Secret Service plans used, now this is going to be twofold. For, for one, you're going to ob obviously going to want to have a lot of stuff to scrap and uh, to learn all the different stars for armor and uh, crafting one secret service right now does only cost one module and after the update it'll cost uh, 15 modules to go and make one so i'm going to go through like every one of my alts i'm intentionally saving about 100 modules at least for each one of the alts so that uh, the night before i can go one by one and uh, every single alt like if i have 100 modules i'm going to make like 20 chests, you know, 20 left arms, 20 right arms, and so on and so on. Um, so that uh, basically I can be set up and ready. And, you know, if I can get really lucky and and of the, the five slots that I make, if I could get like some AP weapon weight or, you know, some strength weapon weight, if I'm going to be using them as a as a mule, then I can just go and replace the first star. Um, but um, fundamentally, what, you, what you're going to want to be doing from now on, like our, the fundamental way that we think about armor is going to be or all gear, not just armor, uh, everything's going to be backwards now. Instead of like thinking about, I'm looking for an unyielding piece, you're going to start thinking, I'm looking for a weapon weight piece. Everything's going to be backwards because switching out and crafting the first star is, is going to be really cheap, but it's going to be really expensive for the bottom star. Throughout the this week or, and the time that's remaining, uh, as, uh, as we've said before in the previous videos, you want to be saving up all of your stuff um, to a scrap later so that you can be able to, to learn all these different things and um, so I've, I've gone a little step further and on my alts I've actually organized them all and um, you can see here like I've these are spread between like three alts I have everything organized by alphabetically and what I'm gonna be doing is I'm gonna start with a and um, like I'll start uh, scrapping all the aristocrats and I'm gonna scrap every aristocrat until I actually learn that particular mod. Like once I learn aristocrats, I'm going to completely stop doing aristocrats and I'm going to move on to assassins. And 
And once I learn assassins, I'm going to stop doing all the assassins. And I'm going to go one by one all the way down uh, to zealots. So once I actually learn all of the first stars, I'm then going to go and see what I've learned uh, as far as the second and third stars. So let's say if I, I learned everything except for like one thing, you know, like if I didn't learn, um, you know, endurance or something as the uh, second star, then I'll go through and I'll start back at the, the top of the list and I'll just scrap the ones that are endurance and then go down there and, you know, hopefully I get all those learned. And then I'll go through and only scrap the ones uh, that are weapon weight or whatever it is that I'm missing for the third star. Now, once that's all done, hopefully, uh, quickly, I'll learn how to do every single one of the mods on that one character. Now, everything that's remaining, I'm going to move over and start on the next all, and so on and so on and so on. I don't want to just go through completely down the list, because if you've already learned how to do all the aristocrats, you don't want to scrap any more of those, because the only way that your alt's going to learn aristocrats is if you're scrapping that first star. All right, everybody. Well, this is just a quick update. I will keep my eyes on everything for the BTS and every all the other big changes, and I will do like a like a really comprehensive full guide a couple days, maybe the weekend before that Friday or so. And um, yeah, we'll get uh, everything all figured out here, and hopefully, all of this is helping you guys. Now, make sure that you do go down in the description and click on all the links. And uh, do check out the first two videos. Um, so a lot of the questions that you may have uh, could have already been addressed with those down there and a bunch of different useful links in there. Also, make sure that you go and click on the Discord link down below. And if you go and ping me at Mr. Morph on Discord um, in there, I will definitely answer any kind of questions that I can. And make sure to leave a comment down below. And if you have any other questions, I would love to address them, and if I don't know the answer, that's a great opportunity to go and figure it out so we can all learn together. So thank you guys all so much for watching, and uh, yeah, so click these two links to the original two videos, and uh, yeah, we'll see you out there in the wasteland.